HR said I had to come and talk to you, doctor. Yes, Mr. Sipowitz. Why don't you come in and have a seat? Okay. So, what seems to be the problem? Yesterday I had a real meltdown. <laughs> You see, almost every day I get piles of discs that I have to burn, and then I have to put sticky labels on each of them. And, well, I got so frustrated that I, I kicked my PC, <laughs> and now my foot's broken. I just burn and print and stick, and then burn and print and stick, and it goes on and on and over and over and every day, and... I think I'm going crazy. Can you help me? Wow. So you have to burn and print and stick labels one disc at a time. That is crazy. Sounds like you need a Bravo SE disc publisher from Primera. What's that? Well, it's the new automated all-in-one disc burner and printer. I have one here myself. I use it to produce my self-help videos. A calm worker is a happy worker. Bravo SC fits perfectly on my desktop. And it's affordable, too. In fact, the lowest cost automated solution available. Wow. That's really cool. How does it work? Well, let me show you. You just drop in up to 20 discs, press go, and kick back. First it loads CDs or DVDs into the built-in recorder. Then it prints directly onto the surface of each disc with full color, high resolution inkjet printing. And to keep you sane, Bravo SE connects with a Windows PC or a Mac. So, my diagnosis is that you have burn, print, and stick, or BPS syndrome. Just get a Bravo SE and the BPS will go away. The Bravo SE will also clear up your time so that you can do more important things around the office. Like what? Maybe like clearing paper jams from the copier. Ah, Michael, we got sort of a problem here. Sort of need to play a little catch up on those 50 CDs we need for Monday. So uh, I am going to need you to go ahead and come in this weekend. Oh, and uh, we need them to look professional. So use those sticky label things. And if you could do that, uh, whew, that would be great. <laughs> he thinks I'm coming in this weekend? Well, there's no way that that's happening. Our department just got this cool new Bravo disc publisher. This thing is great. It burns and prints the disc all by itself. All I do is load the blank disc, set up my job for my Mac or Windows PC, and press go. First, it burns the CDs or DVDs, and then prints my graphics right on the surface. So now I don't have to burn them one at a time on my computer. And no more of those sticky label things. Oh yeah, Bravo's working for me this weekend. I've got a date with the Kung Fu Marathon on cable. I bet you could use a Bravo disc publisher, too. Hello, Susan. A nice new corner office you've got here. I'm just glad to have been promoted, Henry. Right now, we really need you to get those 300 discs ordered for the employee meeting. Everybody gets a copy of the Do Your Best for Our Company CD. Henry really has no idea how we get our CDs and DVDs produced. I actually make them right here on my desk. It's fast and easy with Primera's new Bravo Pro Disc Publisher. 
It automatically burns and prints up to 100 disks at a time while I'm doing my other work. And Bravo Pro connects to either a Windows PC or a Mac. It even includes network software so that other people in my department can send jobs to it. With its two high-speed recorders, the fastest robotics and printing that's twice the speed of other brands, I can get up to 50 CDs burned and printed every hour. But the look of our company's discs is just as important. They've got to look professional. With Bravo Pro, I get 4,800 DPI print resolution, making all of our CDs and DVDs look incredible. Best of all, Bravo Pro is affordable, and it looks great on my desk. The transparent cover keeps the unit quiet and protects all of my recordable media from things like dust, spilled sodas, and coffee. The bottom line, Bravo Pro is fast, robust, and reliable, and it makes me look good. I'll bet that you could use a Bravo Pro in your office, too. And I almost forgot to mention that the reserved parking spot next to the front door is mine, so it would be great if you could just go ahead and park somewhere else.